And now from the forewarned storm center, meteorologist Thomas Geeboy with weather. Well, it just not has been a pleasant day today. Temperatures in the mid 40s, mid and upper 40s, along with rain chances all throughout the day. Had some rain earlier this morning and temperatures right now still hanging around the same. Temperatures are not going to really fall off through tonight. However, it's still going to be cool outside, so you're going to need that extra jacket. As we look at the current satellite radar here in the wiregrass, you can see just a few lingering showers hanging around. However, we should see those begin to mix out, but the chance of rain will be increasing throughout the evening hours. The system that passed yesterday that brought us these cooler conditions well off to the east, you could see causing some wintry weather in South Carolina and North Carolina. But notice down in the Gulf of Mexico, seeing some clouds beginning to creep into Texas, and that's an indication of our next system. That storm system moves out and then you see another area of low pressure that's going to make its way further to the east. It's going to cause some heavy rain here and then you can see a line of wintry precipitation, snow and also sleet and that's where we're going to that's what we're thinking for the most part and then it's going to probably clear out on Thursday thinking it's going to be a just a heavy rainmaker for us possible thunderstorms near to the coast a few snow showers off to the north. It all depends on the track of the low if the low it dips a little bit further south and the snow line will go a little bit further south. But however, if the low makes its way further to the north, then we might actually see a couple thunderstorms here. They're not expecting anything in the way of severe weather, but we mentioned the snow. So if you do have any travel plans into northern Alabama, we're thinking you could see I-20 right here. That's basically where the snow line is where we're thinking. So anywhere from two to four inches, that's what we're thinking for the most part. So it looks like Jackson. Uh, Birmingham and also Atlanta might get in on some of the snow into the next few days. However, let's go ahead and move closer to home. I said that it's going to rain. You can see just a increase in clouds throughout tonight and then we're going to see the in increase of rain as we go throughout the afternoon hours tomorrow. Some rain will be heavy. Got a few areas might see about an inch of rain. Also might hear just a few rumbles of thunder. However, not expecting anything like in the way of any severe weather. Mentioned that before and then should stay r mostly cloudy through Thursday. As for how much rain we're going to see, we're probably going to see some spots maybe localized up to more than an inch of rain. We need the rain for this time of year. However, it's just not going to be very nice outside. And let's go ahead and go through the future temperatures. You can see temperatures going to be into the mid 40s all throughout tonight and also tomorrow morning. So going to be another chilly start tomorrow, only warming up to the mid and upper 40s. However, some spots maybe get a little bit warmer. If the low pressure makes its way further to the north, some areas might be affected by some warmer air, helping it to warm up. However, we're still going to be plenty below where we should be for this time of year. And then cooler temperatures persist as we head into the latter portions of the week. Here's a look at your skycast for tonight. We're going with a low of 41 degrees and tomorrow 48 degrees with a chance of heavy rain. Tomorrow on the Gulf, that's where the things are going to be the most sticky. You got thunderstorms, likely surf hazards, a dangerous chance for rip current. So if you're making your way down there, make sure that you give yourself plenty of time. But here's your extended forecast. Temperatures not going to be very warm. Rain for the next few days, a slight little warm up as we head into the weekend. But overall, temperatures are going to stay much below average, about mm -hmm. 15 degrees. So winter's still hanging around, and tomorrow's just not going to be a very nice day. So make it a Netflix day if you can. Yes, mm -hmm. and we're going to give winter an eviction notice. We are done with yeah. you. Yeah, I'm just ready to just skip spring and just head straight into summer. Right, <laughs> exactly. Thank you. Thanks. Coming up.